Hey everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV where it's the beginning of the week so it's time to run our minion roulette. What are we getting today? We are getting the wind-up cursor. Stop pointing at me, it's quite rude. Today we are here in Revenant's Soul to continue the main story as we are looking to get even with Garlemald, find a way to sneak into their castrum sentry and save our friends. But first let's check in with everyone. Dressing up as soldiers and sneaking in the front door, eh? Well, if you've got the guts to go through with it, then so do I. Oh boy, I always wanted my own Reaper. I would wash her and wax her and name her and... Now, oh, you mechanics. Stealth and subterfuge, Satora, are how we will free our friends. I have every confidence you can play the part of an Imperial soldier. In the wake of the Calamity, the 14th Imperial Legion occupied what remained of Castrum Novum, eventually rebuilding and renaming it Castrum Sentry. The stronghold contains immense manufacturing and storage facilities, and it is the primary supplier of material for Imperial forces stationed throughout Eorzea. Consequently, it is heavily defended. Infiltrating will not be easy. Nevertheless, it is necessary. Ah, it's going to be a tough fight ahead of us, but I believe we can do it. Glowant would like to aid in your mission to rescue the captured Scions. So you have friends to cast from Sentry will want for rescue. That Slathmore knows me too well. Ah, you can count on my help. I've got a score to settle with the Imperials, and I never pass an opportunity to get back at the Horsons. But enough about me, let's talk strategy. Rescuing folk from captivity is right delicate business. A single oversight, just one little blunder, and it's all over. You can't leave any room for uncertainty. For starters, you need to confirm beyond a shadow of a doubt uh, that your friends are what you think are where you think they are. You don't want to risk your neck only to discover they've been moved elsewhere. But how can you find out, you ask? By following these instructions. If you approach Sentry from these, you'll see a swampland to your left called the Tangle. Get in there, never mind all the marbles, and navigate your way to the southwestern corner. You'll come upon some drainage pipes coming down from the stronghold. Don't ask me how I know, but one of them leads back up to the command tower. If you listen closely, it might be as you can eavesdrop on some of the happen happenings within. Once we know for certain your friends are there, we'll move to the next stage of the operation. Now get going and godspeed. Oh yes, and just remembered, uh, I'm going in as Summoner today. You may have noticed, but I try to regularly, uh, regularly rotate which job I'm using in the main story to try and give all of them a little screen time, even if not all of them are getting a little bit of, uh, you know, actual combat time. And it helps spread that really nice main scenario experience around because it is quite a bit. The main scenario quests give enough experience to keep like three, maybe four? Somewhere from two to four. In the two to four range of jobs leveled up to where they need to be. So you can easily multi-class in this game uh, and have it be viable just going through the main story. You just have limits. You do you do need to do other stuff to keep all of your job leveled. Okay, there's the castrum. There's a toad. Hello, Nyx. And here is the tangle. Okay, let's dip into the tangle. And circle around this way. Where is that pipe? Should be pretty close to the castrum. Ah, there it is. Alright, let's get over here, and then we'll need to clear out a few morbles. Oh, dear. Here, get out here, Carvuncle. Let's do this. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, somehow that missed me. What a relief. Also, I've been playing a lot more Summoner on my main, and I actually rearranged my hotbars quite a bit. Uh, Ready Aegis. Was I putting that here? I think I was putting that there. Gemshine, I think that's in the right spot. Yeah, this seems right. I did a lot. I, I've changed up my hotbar significantly on. Oops. On my main account. And I am really liking how they're set up right now. Okay. I th think that's good. Yeah. All right. Now then, let's go ahead and check out the drainage pipe. And you, wind up cursor, need to stop pointing at me. Oh God, Shikoe. Hello. Here, eat some Garuda to the face. I've gained control of all of those icons, you Garleans. So, oh, wait, you're not Garleans, you're Shigwe. 
But I have gained control of all of the icons these Garleans so detest. All right, there we are. Now, let's see if we can hear anything. The faint sound of conversation echoes down the pipe. What of the captive? Does she still refuse to speak? She may as well be a deaf mute for all the information we've gotten out of her. The others aren't much better. The Elizin gets on my nerves most of all. Every time he opens his mouth, it's only to spout gibberish. I do wonder, why is the Tribunus so obsessed with this Minfilia woman? They say she possesses some mystical power, something we Garleans don't have. Mystical power, like the kind the Beastmen use? How am I supposed to bloody know? If you're so curious, why don't you ask the Tribunus, uh, Tribunus yourself? As well try to tumble her. I like my head where it is, thank you very much. Our break is over. Best we get back to our stations. The footfalls grow fainter until all is silent. Okay, well, they are definitely there in the cast room. We know that. Now then, let's get back to Alphano. Alright, Alphano, I return with good news. The Minfilia and friends are, in fact, still in cast room sentry, so we don't need to worry about them being moved. It's good to see you again, Zatora. I'm given to understand you have conducted some reconnaissance. Tell me, what were you able to learn? So, Minfilia and the others are indeed a cast from Sentry. Their presence thus confirmed, we may proceed with the mission. While you were afield, Sid took the liberty of devising a plan of action. Pray have the, uh, pray have the details from him. Alright, Sid, what's the plan? Good work, Satora. As Elfino has already told you, we've plotted out a course for the rescue. The gist of it is unchanged. We disguise ourselves as Imperial soldiers and infiltrate the stronghold. Glamont is looking into ways to procure a suit of Magitek armor. In the meantime, I need your assistance for some preparation of my own. Minfilia and the others are counting on us, Satora. Let's not keep them any, uh, waiting any longer than necessary. Alright, and we'll get the details on what Sid wants us to do next time. For now, we hit level 50! Our first, first job to hit level 50. Let's go ahead and replace that Zircon ring with a Master Arcanist ring. Hoo 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 hoo! That is some nice stats right there. That is some really nice stats. Oh, absolutely yes. And that jumps, oh goodness, that jumps our item level all the way up to a good 56. Okay, it's not just the ring that pulled us up. Uh, now that we hit level 50, the Menfina's earrings just got a major boost in strength. Uh, since we're at the level cap for a Realm Reborn, they jumped up to the item level cap for a Realm Reborn, which is item level 130. So these are now item level 130 earrings, even though they're, they're, it says 430 right there. So we just got a massive boost in our uh, in our abilities from that. All right, did we get anything special, like any new actions for hitting level 50? Those might actually come from quests. Nope, nope, nothing new. At least up there, and nothing new down here. All right, that's fine. Uh, actually, any roll actions? Probably not. Yeah, no. All right, how about Scholar? Scholar's likely, oh, Scholar definitely has a few new things, I think. Right? I'm not mistaken. Level 50, got anything new? Oh, Sacred Soils from the quest, okay. Well, Scholar will be getting something new soon. Anyways, I'm delighted at this. Next time on Final Fantasy XIV, now that we've hit level 50 on Scholar and Summoner, next time we're going to take a real quick break and actually go do some goldsmithing. Level 50 goldsmithing. I'll see everyone next time for that. <laughs>